Administrator Rosekind, thanks for joining us. You know, this is really an exciting time. The issues have changed dramatically. I think the most important thing is the four Ds. I mean, you really came in and uh, you changed the conversation about impaired driving. And, uh, you know, to, to some extent, I'm interested in knowing the inspiration for that uh, and how you feel like that's going. There are probably two parts to that. One is really getting us to focus on anyone impaired behind the wheel is dangerous and they're going to be a risk to themselves and everyone around them. And so while we may need to segment that and understand what got them to impairment, when they're behind the wheel and dangerous, we got to focus on making them safer. So, so that was the thing about impairment's impairment. Let's get rid of that. The four D's part, and why that's important, is because if you want to figure out how to make the changes, then you have to understand what path got them to that impairment. So drunk, drug, distracted, drowsy, that really allows you to know what's my specific channel, what's my hook to basically deal with drunk driving or distracted driving or drowsy. Your intervention, your strategies are gonna focus on whatever actually got them there. Of the four Ds, not everybody's drinking, not everybody's <laughs> taking a drug, and not everybody's on their phone. Right. Everyone's gotta be alert, awake, and that means 100% of people behind the wheel have to worry about drowsiness. So that's one that affects all of us.